Hey guys, you're with your careers, and welcome back to my FIFA 16 Liverpool Kurama where last time left off. We had a crazy game against Manchester City. Seriously, if you did not see that episode, well, especially that match, go and watch it. it. Now, in this episode, I thought I was going to have two games against Brentford, but as you can see, I do have a game against Brentford, but the the next uh, FA Cup fixture has been placed before the second leg against Brentford, so that will be the second match in this is uh, in this episode, and the game is against Newcastle. So, oh, oh dep so depending, hopefully. I can do well enough against Brentford in the first leg, so I don't even have, so I can sim this second leg, leg and just focus on mm, the uh, transfer window. Made a few changes to the cup team, which if you did not see the last episode. It will um, also be a bit of confusion. As you can see, it's now a 4. I guess you'd call that a 4 2 two, three, one, or 4 5 1. Variation of a 4 5 1. And as you can see, there is no Ayanacho. That's because he went to Atleg Bilbao in the last episode. He is gone. And, um,. Sean also went out on loan. And so the second team is left with one striker, and that is Divock Origi. So let's do this. I'm gonna wait for the first leg. I'm not this year, the English League Cup doesn't always get the plaudits I think it deserves. Going to um, focus on getting away goals. I just want to get goals. Teams take it easy, don't they? In terms of their team selection early on, but you get to this stage and it's a huge, huge competition. So uh, this is going to be fiercely competitive, I think. So here we go. Brentford play Liverpool. Check for you on how Brentford will line up for this match. Well, more often than not, we're looking at teams that shape up this way, Alan. Yeah, such a pop. Good block by Shea Ojo. Go, Costa. Come on, give me someone running. Thank you. Sanchez. Run, Sanchez, run. Trying to keep the ball. Not anymore. Tchaikovsky. He gets him off the ball. Oh, well, fairly. Yeah, I should uh, specify. It wasn't a foul. He, I don't, the pressure. He just took the ball. He didn't even. He's the one we're focusing on. He, I think with good reason. Hint of a foul. On here. That's a shot. Well and vibe with a horrific shot. Pull it. Iturbe. One Manuel Iturbe. Very. Weak challenge. What's the challenge? And the ball. He. Why did he hit it forward? I was telling him to pass it back. Act. <clears throat> so annoying. And that they don't listen. It's an easy catch for Dragoski. Hit it. He's having a good game. Costa. Can he get there? He can't. For the goalkeeper here, or for the defending team, and they will play from the goalkeeper now. All the spotlight at the moment. On Good the job team. winning the header, Emery. The talk of him taking on Turbe again. As well. Oh, interesting. I mean, he's clearly a talented club manager. You know. Let me pass the right person that time. At least the directed my pass in the right direction. It was just blocked by the defender and not actually passed to him. I sound like I'm getting angry at my players. I'm not. I'm getting angry at the game. 
for being broken as hell. Now McLeod. Iturbe. Ooh, Iturbe. Costa. Can't play the pass before tackled, but it comes to Emery Chan. Ojo. Fancy footwork. Che Ojo! Oh, that's a good block. Wins a corner. corner. The defender, for some reason, didn't decide to decide to leave it go out. Whatever. Ojo will keep that in. Shot's and wins another corner off the defense. Bidwell is being credited with the block. Yeah, you can see him getting his toes to it. Strong, powerful clearance. Chan. That's perhaps as much down to the conditions. <sighs> Not sure why I tried that. Yeah, it's a wet surface and obviously a wet ball. Your timing has got to be spot on. The good thing about these pitches these days, even when we're getting rain like we're getting here, it just goes straight through. So, it does. And, uh, oh, that's that's a poor challenge by the returning Mario Desquilla, who uh, missed a few matches with injury. He was injured for a bit. Sliding in. This is his first game back, and he's already on a yellow card. A dangerous territory, really. Well, he's dived in. It's a reckless one. Wonderful save. Had to really reach Great save by Dragoski. I think Chan had it covered anyway. But uh, my keeper pulled off a great save. Did exactly what you want from your keeper in that kind of situation. Ojo. Costa. Sanchez, great work. Give him some port. Position here. Iturbe. Costa. Wins a corner. An unlikely corner. They won there, but uh, I'll take it. Try an old favorite from my Gladback career. Oh, the short corner works. Pull it. Hit it breaks the deadlock. Liverpool have got the goal. Well, it was a, a really Yo, those short corners. Finish by the boy. They have brought me a lot of goals. Oh, well worth analyzing again. Well, well, they worked fantastically well in the when I was managing Borussia Mission Gladbach. And it has worked here for Nathan Pullet to break the deadlock. Liverpool have the lead here. One nil. Well, there's a long way to go. <laughs> and there's the halftime whistle. There are two legs in this as if to. But they are leading. They rub salt into the freshly up moon to Brentford. But they were probably think hey, if they could get in the halftime. Yeah, the no, well, they'd have a chance. Now they'd have. Now they have to come from behind. First half, they'd be delighted. Jake Bidwell. Chan can't keep the ball, but he's going to win it back. Someone give him an option. Ojo. Really, Shay? Really? Really? Well, been an influence on this first half. Uh oh. Oh, judges. Oh, uh, judge was through. He should have kept the ball instead of passing it. Because your man blew it over the bar. Or judge might have gotten the shot at least away on target. This could be it. Origi. Oh, he's broken away. Origi. Oh. I thought the defender would be past. We've run right past the ball. Oh. Oh, in goes the cross. Well, they kept up. They've opened them up here. Emery Chan 
can't get the shot away, he ran straight into McLeod. Or McLeod? The old? Me lick out. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Ta. Ojo. He's seen a pass, cut it out. <sighs> That's another wayward pass from, from Ojo. It's I think we all knew deep down, Alan, that this was a deal. I don't know where to... Where that's the game doing now, or if that was him? Form had been affected by all the transfer speculation. I mean, I do have other options. Hmm. I'm gonna make a pair of changes. Wilson and I are going to come on for Ojo and Costa. So he can get that off his shoulders now. Liverpool want to make an alteration. They're going to bring a new player on. He's given possession. Costa. Pull it. Deschilio. Mattia Desciglio. Iturbe. Iturbe. Hey, oh, no one can put the ball in. And it went over both Origi and Dojo's heads. Colin. Costa wins the ball fairly, says the referee. Hey, Sanchez! His shot was blocked. Ball back to the goalkeeper. Mar trying to score to or win a corner. Or something to cause a break in the game. Him, Origi wins a corner. The corner. And that means the introductions of well, this mean for the team. Ibe to and Wilson. Two new players on. And he's in there with pull it! Ooh! Pull it almost. It was to repeat his first half. At heroics. A little further off target. There's Diwok Origi. Comes to Chan. There's the goal scorer, Pollitt. In the short time that remains. Turbe. Origi! An easy goal, 2-0! Oh, Diwok Origi's first game without a supporting striker. Or, and he, it into the bottom left. he gets probably the easy, one of the easiest goals the striker will ever get. Take it, that goal. It's for some reason the defense and the keeper b neither paid any sort of attention to him. He just, they were just like, yeah. Stood there in pretty much awe as Origi scored his fourth of the competition and the second of the game. Shouldn't they 2-0 here, not much time to go. What impact will that have on the next game? Well, Liverpool can well, get another just one. United just be absolutely the, sure. The way they've played out here today, they'll be full of confidence, I think. Because you never know who these lower league teams can sometimes surprise you. Pull it. Emery Chan. Brigi. Can you get a brace? Yes, he can! Fantastic! Stuff from Divock Origi. He an assist for Emre Chan and Brent held out for most of the first half until a late a corner broke them down. And then and now two late each second half goals from Divock Origi have absolutely put a two crucial nails. In the, in the a coffin of Brentford. Team leading deserve the margin of what's going to be a very comfortable victory. Well, it's a 90-minute match, and there's only two minutes to go. So, referee has chosen to add call it. two extra minutes. Oh, the foot back, foot the over Brentford, hurt instead of helping them. Oh wow, that is a dirty, dirty foul. The defending team might be in trouble. Oh. They might regret conceding this. An obvious 
take one for the team moment from the Brentford captain right there. Bejaland. Bejaland. Beland. Beljand. I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce his name, but it's clear what he was doing there. Obviously, he, he saw the danger. He didn't. He wanted to minimize the damage and leave it at three. I've shot is straight at the keeper anyway. And there's the full time whistle. Well, it's the halfway stage of the semi-final, Alan. Halfway to another her, her final. I think it went as well as they could have possibly hoped. Well, the job is half done. Mm. The brace from Dave walker Rigi and the first half header from Nathan Pollitt. Give me a good advantage to go into that second leg. Hey. Yeah, look at that. Wow, Barcelona are trying to buy he Sanchez. It's absolutely not. 16 years old, I can make something out of this kid. And Martin Costa as well. The fact that, you know, his stamina is, you know, is a bit of a problem. I haven't gotten a... I need to uh, open, I need to get the uh, player development section available to me again. An offer for Emre Chan. Try and get as much money out of him if I am going to lose him. I will definitely have to replace him somehow. Although, I might just put Wilson in with a pullet. And that's what's going to happen. 9.5, another offer for Costa. It's Ipswich. Two transfer offers? Now, I told you why I wanted Sunland, and you didn't listen, so. And right. Now Costa's in, um, is in a good place. Wait, I'm in the wrong section. Um. So, player. Er, Costa... Easy way. There we go. There he is. Remove from loan list. There we go. Who else is listed for loan who I can't afford to lose? Not no one. Anyone out on loan that I can use back? No, no, we're good. And there's a uh, who's who Sean went to. In case you didn't see the last last episode, he went to a Burnley. He, who of course in real life are back in the Premier League. Cristiano Ronaldo. Uh, sorry, he's. Ronaldo, it's a cup of games, so you I mean you don't play cup games. But I am gonna make a few changes. I 
Is, you know, just just to spice it up, I'm going to instead of playing Skigo, I'm gonna put on in um Trace Priestess and instead of Jonathan Ta, I'm going to play Fink, which is what I'm calling this guy because I cannot pronounce that. So if anyone can pronounce that, feel free. <laughs> and uh, I'm also going to start Nathaniel. Uh, Nathaniel? Nathaniel. I'm not going to start Nathaniel Klein. I'm going to play Samuel Wilson and Jordan Ibe on the wings in s well. Brito is not ready to play. He? He in this match. And the rest of the team is as normal. Will be the first chance I get to play with for them. Tim Krul starts in goal to uh, use Fink in my defense. So let's see how he does. The chances he gets could be the difference between him being a Liverpool player or come the start of next season. And it's Wilson. Iturbe. Iturbe. Now he's looking for support. Here's Wilson. Here's Wilson. And shoots. Goes for it and scores. As instantly, it one of the changes I made it at this just before the game him has paid off. And the keeper's got no oh. chance. A great so hard to his right. He passed from Turbe and a great shot equaling a great goal. Oh oh all in all, everything is great. And that has opened the scoring. One nil here. Sam Wilson is on the scoreboard in the FA Cup. And it's now with Liverpool. Ibe. Sanchez. And it's Wilson. Wilson again. Divock Origi. Here's Divock Origi. Gets in the box. Sanchez! Ooh. The top of the bar. If he had scored there is... His uh, stock were going up. So, it's a straight Ings, but gets it back. Chan. Here's I. It's with Newcastle again. Loses the ball to uh, Daryl Yammat. Sanchez wins it back from Talvin, though. Looking for option, pull it. Emery Chan, Useful block in those and then neat his block equals a corner. Because of that deflection. And Oof. Knocked away long, and the throw with a bit of 14. It was pressed. Yes, it was. Going up for the header, or at the back post, the instead of pull it this time. Now it's going to add to the thrills of a few spills, possibly. Well, it normally does, doesn't it? Wilson, like it because, Sanchez. Uh, quite often, I mean, you've got a few more chances in the box with the uh, bounce of the ball and what have you. 
Sanchez wins another corner. You can see it again. Her. Smith. That's the goal that's given them the lead. Fink. Oh, what a debut for a team that would have been. That would have given them a great opportunity to uh, be coming back. Heck at the start of next season as a permanent sign. That's the way to win the ball. Aye. Avoids the chop and from Talvin. Hmm. Waiting for an option. No one came. Why was no one getting open? Prestius wins the ball back. Gives it straight. Eight back to Newcastle. That's a cross the field to try and switch the play. That call back. Good tackle. Fink. Rigi can't get there. Her. Luckily, the game stopped him before he made contact with Tim Krull. Also, he doesn't pick up a cheap yellow card. Daryl Yamat had for Newcastle. Leading, but it's a pretty slender margin at this stage. They've got half time coming up, and they want to get there with this lead still intact. Great tackling technique. So, when Sanchez working together, they get the ball off Talvin. A block by you. Hama equals a throw. Sanchez. I tussle between the two loses it again to Daryl Yamat. Uh, it seems to so it's be swaying. And in, in now Ibe isn't exactly doing well. He's not, um. I don't know if he has the, uh. Maybe it's not enough strength from John Ibe? What's his strength? 71. Is Ojo's better than that? Oh no, it's much, much worse. So he would definitely not win a battle of strength against Daryl Yamat. I guess I can give Ibe a few more minutes before I bring on Cristiano Ronaldo. Because I have to bring him on at some point in this match or I'll see he'll start or, uh, whinging that he's not being played. Sanchez. Well, you can see what he was trying There's to that by only to Anita. Things can't get his shot away. His great block from, from Pollitt. Go with Tarbay. Avoids the challenge. Hmm. I don't even know what that was. Oh! Oh, Riggy can't keep his shot down. Tim Crew is off his line. All he has to do is put it in. And Chelsea in the market. Of course. Got their man. Well, 35 million or thereabouts isn't a small figure, but uh, loads of potential with this lad. Well, no shots at all so far for Newcastle United. Prestius. Great ball to Iturbe. He whoops it in. It's going to come back to Iturbe. No, it's not. He loses the ball. Oh. Oh. That's a foul. Free kick. He's judged to foul Rolando Aarons. I think Paula is getting tired. So I'm going to bring on Martin Costa as well as CR7. Hmm. Substitution for Liverpool. Dragoski belongs that to the easily. Coming up for you, of course, on EA Sports, the presentation of the Barclays Premier League fixture for Newcastle United. They'll be hosting Spurs. Yeah, I've had a lot of supporters get excited about it, and I am as well. He's undercut that pass. Mm. 
Nita. Beat my player, Sissoko! Great save by Dragos. Sissoko is offside, it doesn't even matter. What does matter is both Costa and Ronaldo have entered the match. Hard to miss Ronaldo standing over there on the side. Still 20 minutes to go. On the attack here, Sizoka. Jesus! Great hands. Dragoski easily collects the ball. So we'll restart. Ronaldo, why weren't you in position? At least he caused the problem from which it's to winning the ball back. The corker clears it. Idara. Sizoka. Newcastle want to make a substitution here. And it's now with Liverpool. Perez. On the balance sheets, there's plenty of profit on the scoreline. It's looking like a loss for Newcastle United. Sissoko tries to do some skills and loses the ball. Oh, Wilson and Origi. Is up against Corker. Foul! Foul! What? How is that not a foul? Oh, absolute BS. What absolute BS? Liverpool haven't let them look like doing it. Dragowski clear it. There we go. Five minutes now, and the margin is still just one goal. Quick tempo to the passing. Call back. Opposition can't get near them. Dragowski should have left that for the goal kick. Nick, that wasn't going in. Maybe now, one last corner, one last chance. Newcastle, well you can see how who desperate they he are. Or their keeper was in my box. Here they come again. It might be their last chance here to get something from the game. Clear it. Dragowski takes it and lash it down the pitch. Let's come straight to Origi. Hey! One on one with hit the keeper and he gives it to Costa to wrap it up. Ah, <laughs> oh, they thought Origi was gonna go for the shot. No, never or ever underestimate how sweaty he I can get. In truth, Alan, this is what we expected. The dominant side. And they're showing that on the scoreline. Yeah, we don't I saw we the keeper was just. If I had kept going where Rigi well, Crew would have strikers, collected it, probably. But I got it to Costa in time, and he buries it in an empty net. Haha! <laughs> so it has finished here at 2 0, and a very good game it was. A confirmation then. Two goals from my central attacking midfielders, both Sam Wilson and, and Martin Costa. Give me the win over Newcastle. Fantastic. Whew. No, not Brito. Um, Costa is there. One get up his stamina. I guess the uh, standard beat your man because that puts. I feel. I find that always puts up the stamina the best. Should be getting a Fritzo going up, hopefully, anyway. 
Let's see. I mean, he's so close. I don't see how he can. And there we go. He finally went up. Up. I feel like he, I was training him to 67 for months. And that's just because it, it's seven days at a time. <laughs> You're welcome. Another offer for Emery Chan. Southampton. Southampton again. Was it? Wasn't it Southampton last time, or was it Sunderland? No, I'm just gonna reject the offer. Until, well, my valuation, which is still 15 and a half million, is met, then, yeah. Another offer for Montpellier this time. I don't know whether Emery would want to go to France. Maybe he will. That's a, it's up to Montpellier to meet the 15.5 million pound asking price. First, oh, um, okay then, huh, um, they did, they said they would, um, Interesting. I better at least have a... Oh, don't tempt me again. Don't tempt me. <laughs> the game is doing something evil. Don't do that. No. I refuse to go for the... For similarity, he might be good. Look at him. Uh... Who the hell is this guy? Stupid random mask. Or CDM, that could be a good option. Mm. 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 What's your man's name? He plays for Valencia. You know what? I'll do this off camera. Because uh, uh, the thing is running on. And so I'm going to end it here and you'll see here are the results in the next episode. So thanks for watching and hope you enjoyed. Smash the like button if you did, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and until next time I hope you all 